In today's video, I'm gonna show you best of the best Fortnite optimization you need to get the double performance out of your any PC in Fortnite. So make sure to follow this whole guide and let's get started. Here is a quick message if you want to get the lower ping and lower response time out of your mouse and keyboard in Fortnite or any other game. So guys, you need gear booster on your PC. This is just one click setup. You can download the software for free from the link in the description. So guys, in the very first step, we are going to add the custom mid special Epic Launcher command in our Epic Games Launcher. So for that, go for your Windows search, search for Epic Games, then open up your Epic Games Launcher on your PC. Guys, once you have opened up the Epic Games Launcher on your PC, you need to go for this login icon. Now open up the settings of your Epic Games. Now scroll all the way down and here you will find out this Fortnite. So click on the drop down. Here you will find out this additional command line argument. So guys, simply use here the same exact command which I'm putting right here. And this is the custom made command myself. So guys, in the very first step here, you will find out land play that will optimize your network. And next you will find out here minus no force feedback. This will disable the feedback to the engine that directly help you to get more performance. No sound, then minus no splash. No texture streaming. This will stop to loading the high resolution texture and give you a huge FPS boost. Next, you will find out here minus use all available code. This will allow your computer to give the maximum performance of your processor to the Fortnite. So once you put here this command, by the way, you can find out this command from the description. So guys, once you put here this command, now you need to click on this drop down again. Now the next step, you need to go for this library option, find out here this Fortnite, go for three doors, and here you will find this option. So guys, go inside this option. Now from here, guys, uncheck the director's 12 if you are not using on the PC, but basically I'm using it on my PC. Next here, you will find a resolution texture. So make sure to also uncheck this box. This will give you a huge FPS boost if you disable the settings. Now scroll down here you will find a pre-download Steam Acid. This will optimize your network because this will start downloading Steam Acid while you're playing game and causing the packet loss and high ping. So therefore make sure to download these Steam Acid before playing the Fortnite. Next here you will find additional languages. This is on your personal preference. Now click on the apply button and guys that's it. So guys now the next step you need to download the process lesson on your PC and you can find out the link in the descriptions of my this video. Make sure to download the same version on your PC. Once you download double tap here, click OK, click or agree, next and install the software on your PC. After installation here you will find out this kind of interface. You need to go straight toward this main tab and here you will find out active power profile. Go for it if there's some available inside this box so guys go for it otherwise you can simply select out here the high performance the default one from the windows and one of the best for you now again go for this main option now here you will find the pro brainless enable uncheck it from here then smart stream enable uncheck it from here ideal saver enable make sure to uncheck it from here and at the end you will find that performance mode enable select out here this option for getting the more performance now once you select all this now you need to go for the next step that is your active profile now for that you need to launch the fortnite on your background but guys fortnite is right now in the updating so guys i'm using the epic games launcher as an example of the fortnite launcher so you need to go for your fortnite go for cp purity go for always and set it onto the high now again go for your fortnite launcher go for cp affinity go for always and just select out here your old cp cores and thread now go for i and O that is your input and output priority go for always and set it also onto the high for reducing the input delay next here you will find memory priority go for always set it onto the normal or below normal so guys simply go with the normal now again go for your fortnite now you need to go for power profile and set it onto the high performance power plan for your fortnite again i'm telling you i'm using the epic games launcher as the example of the fortnite launcher because fortnite is updating in the background so guys now you need to go for the next step that is the more tab so guys go inside it now here you will find out hard throttle go for always and set it onto the no throttle after that now you need to go for this disable idle saver and disable the saving on your pc once you follow all the settings in the fortnite now simply click on this minimize button or close this process less application and this will keep running in your system tray so guys now the next step we are going to optimize our fortnite game use settings so for that press windows R together from your keyboard and type here percentage local add data percentage and hit enter now scroll down go for fortnite folder open up fortnite game folder go for save config windows client and here you will find that game user settings so right click here go for show more option and click on the edit Inside here you will find that all the optimization for the Fortnite. So in the very first step, go for B motion blur, set it on false. B show grass, set it on false. Now scroll down, go for latency tweak 2, set it on 2. Build density flash, set it on to the false. Now scroll down, go for DLS quality, set it on 1. 
use nanite set it on for the false after that now scroll down here you will find that b 120 fps mode make sure to also set it on to the false because this will lock your fps onto the 120 after that now go for is energy saving enable ideal make sure to turn off all the energy saving features now you need to scroll down and at the end here you will find out the scalability group or the graphic settings of your fortnite so guys resolution set it on to the 100 percent view distance set it on to the far that is the two anti nosing shadow quality global illumination quality reflection quality post processing quality texture quality effect quality foolish quality shading quality and landscape quality make sure to set all the settings onto the zero for having the more performance by lowering the resolutions and effect after doing all the settings go for file option click on the save button and save the settings in your game settings now close out of it by the way you can also download the pre-edited file from the link in the description with the pack of the process lasso and you can simply paste it here and apply all the settings on your pc in just one click i hope you love this video please make sure to drop a like subscribe to my channel and see you again in the next video